The Baldwin County Sheriff's Office is reminding people to be on guard for scammers. As WKRG News 5's Whitney Leibold reports tonight, these latest scams can be awfully tricky. Yeah, the Baldwin County Sheriff's Office have already had 10 scam cases so far this year in which victims have lost hundreds of dollars. Whether it's a sketchy phone call or an online message, lately scammers are reaching out to Baldwin County residents fishing for anything and everything. Most of these are confident scams and what they do is either you get a call or you may even get a Facebook message or somebody that appears to be a friend with you on social media or LinkedIn and uh, they try to build some confidence with you. You know, they chat with you um, and the next thing you know, they make some outrageous offer that if you provide them a little bit of money, they're able to return uh, some big return. And Reed says the most popular scam recently is a scammer telling people they have won the lottery. Hey, you've won the, the lottery or you've won some amount of money, but we need you to send in. You have to buy this $50 ticket or $100 ticket or whatever the case may be. And next thing you know, somebody's gone out, gotten a gift card, uh, called in, giving them the number off the back of the gift card, immediately that money's gone. Reed says the scams that happen sometimes seem legit. He told News 5 a few different ways to prevent being scammed. You know, ask for their physical address, their website, or get a number to call them back on. Uh, a lot of these scams are getting pretty sophisticated, and sometimes they can port numbers, and it may look very legitimate. But if you start asking questions and digging a little bit, nine times out of ten, they'll quit calling you. Now, if you're a victim of a recent possible scam, reach out to your local law enforcement agency to report it. In Baldwin County, Whitney Leibel, WKRG News 5.